Welcome to Lima, Peru. Tonight we're playing at a crazy big festival. There's some rappers on there. I found like the biggest rap tune from Lima, Peru. It's fucking vibes, isn't it? They wouldn't let me out of the country. Welcome to Santiago, Chile. A guy with a gun walks us through the airport. I felt like I needed to shit myself the whole time. James Hyde. Yo, check this out. Welcome to Lima, Peru. I've never been here before. And it looks wild. Do you want to do a 360? Tonight we're playing at a crazy big festival here. The lineup's big and it's kind of weird as well. There's some rappers on there. There's some DJs of other genres on there. We're going to see how, how it goes. And then tomorrow we are going to Chile, Santiago. Another place I've never been to before. It's going to be a fun episode. Who does this? Let's go. I'm gonna to touch the mic to the bar every time. I missed. Yeah. This, it's like a sync button for pull-ups. And do you know what it would be like to do a pre-recorded set? <laughs> pre-recorded set. Uh, we've got a few hours to go till the show. I like it here, it's really cool. We're in a really nice hotel, and I thought the gym would be really good, but it's not, it's just nice. That makes sense, it's shit and nice. Uh, so yeah, it's a late one tonight. So even though it's 2 p.m. now, we still got like 16 hours till the show or some shit. It's gonna be fun. We are here at Soundcheck. Ben and I are going to set up the mics. It looks pretty wavy. We've had a um, stage change, um, but I can't lie, I actually prefer this one because we've got mountains and um, it's going to look wavy. Anyway, Rash needs us. Give you an update later. We've got radios on now, we're official. All right, Ben and I have set up the mics. Um, Rash is sound checking. Um, we are gonna go to the front of the house and set up the cameras. <laughs> Transition. All right, just finished sound check. Um, that took forever. Um, yeah, there were some rappers sound checking on stage. Um, but I couldn't film it because Ben and I were trying to get wristbands for about two hours. Um, Rash, how was it for you, bro? Long process. It's been a long process from start to finish. Yeah, this is a it's a bit of a long one, but um, yeah. We're on the way back to the hotel now. Gonna go see James, grab some food, and then we're gonna come back, set up all the cameras again, and yeah. Oh, and it rained, so hopefully it doesn't rain. Transition. Yo, what was Soundcheck saying? It was it was cool, bro. It was interesting. Um, some rap music I've never heard of before, but it, it sounded cool. Sometimes I like it when I have to play on the same stage as like loads of different genres of music because it's like more of a challenge. Because it's weird when you're a DJ it's very hard to compete with the energy of someone who's like jumping around and singing and rapping and stuff. Um, and I feel like if anyone can compete with that, it's probably me from, from the DJ world. But yeah, I, I honestly, I was expecting it to be like a house music festival and um, it turns out it ain't. So <laughs> I made the maddest intro for this set, bro. The maddest intro. I just fast forward. Can I be honest? I still want your hands up on my body. So once you've got that, 
Everything else is taken care of, isn't it? <laughs> um, yeah, it put me on after anyone with an intro like that. It's all good. And then the rest of the set, honestly, I'm playing a two hour set and it's a sunrise set as well. The sun comes up at six and I'm playing until six. So I've kind of taken it more housey as it goes. Um, I'm excited, man. It's my first time in Lima, Peru. And oh my God, hang on, I got to play you this. I found like the biggest rap tune from Lima, Peru and made an edit of it. Fucking vibes, isn't it? That's fucking sick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, the second drop's even better. <laughs> <laughs> no idea what he's saying. Doras, two horas, or Doro, two horas. I've got a feeling it means like doing two whores. Is that what it means? You speak Spanish? I don't speak dirty Spanish. <laughs> At first, I thought it meant two hours. I was like, oh yeah, he's doing something for two hours. Or and I was like... Horas, horas does mean hours. Oh, does it? Oh, right. So maybe it's not as bad as I was thinking. I don't know. All right. <laughs> Who's it by? Hang on. During two hours. Is that what it means? Yeah. I think that's what it means. <laughs> Spanish hype, I'm going to fucking slay me. I'm so sorry. Our Spanish is terrible. Anyway, let's get to this fucking show. Yo, we're backstage at the festival. They got really long grass. <laughs> Peggy Goose playing right now. Banging. I think we're getting in this bus to go to the other stage. Transporte Turistico. No. No transporte. <laughs> Is that the beach over there? I don't know, you know. It looks like it must be. All right, so basically, we're at the second stage. There's only about 20 people in front of the stage right now, because Peggy Goo is playing on the other stage. Now, we are fucking praying that there's enough people who want to see me in Lima, Peru, that this stage gets fucking busy. You go first because you've got to get out. Yeah. Um, I'm giving it a nine. It was a good show. Uh, what could have been better? <laughs> Miguel. Um, <laughs> Did it all be good? Um, the communication with the team. 
the, not us, the festival team. Peace out, A Town. I give it a 9.5. See you later, Rash. Bye. Peace up. He's, got, he's got to get an early flight. Peace up, A Town. <laughs> I give it a 9.5, it's, it's just too fucking humid for me. I literally, the second I started, I was like, wow, I am pouring out water like I have a leak all over. So yeah, sorry, it's not anyone's fault, apart from mine for being a fucking pussy. Ben? Um, I give it a nine. I would say the only thing, yeah, just like the organization at the beginning, but apart from that, the show was sick. James killed it, we all killed it, so yeah, sick. Wallace! Oh. Um, Come on, mate, don't forget about yourself. You already know I'm going to say it was too hot, too humid. <laughs> He's right, though. He's right. Thank you. Um, and to clarify something earlier about the song we showed before the show, the lyrics were very vulgar. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Oh, did you do some research? No, I just kind of listened a bit more closely. Right. Because I'm Spanish. better Spanish. Look at me. Can, yeah, give me the camera. No, don't actually pass it to me. Just oh. like talk, put, yeah. Right, fun fact about Wallace. He's actually Spanish. Okay. You, think I, you think I'm lying, but he actually is. He was born in Spain. In the morning, well, in the afternoon, we're going to fly to Santiago, Chile. Rash has already gone now because he has to go to sound check. I don't know how he does it. He's incredible at just falling asleep on planes and stuff like that. It takes me about an hour and a half to fall asleep. So, yeah, hopefully we get some sleep because we still have to leave at about lunchtime and it's 6.36 now. Um, so, yeah, it's going to be good. Transition. I didn't think I was going to make it, but bro, they wouldn't let me out of the country. I had to, basically someone fucked up my visa, someone like the promoter or something. So I had to stand in this queue and then they were like, you have no visa. I'm like, can I go? And they're like, no, you have to pay. So I, I don't know how much I paid, but I was like, take my money, let me out. We're good. Santiago, Chile. Um, we just landed and a guy with a gun walked us through the airport and now we have a massive security guard with us and you can probably see him in the background of this shot. Is he there? He's so big. Time travel is shit. Do you know why? We lost two hours today to a time zone change. Um, and I didn't need that. We're supposed to be going to the club in five minutes, but we've only just got to the hotel and I drank so much coffee and I only had three hours sleep and I don't feel at my best. But you know what? I'm still excited for the show and I don't mind because I know it'll be great. So last night I made that edit, Doro <laughs> Dos. Or us, <laughs> which is not about two whores, sadly. Um, and the craziest thing happened. I was going through my comments on Instagram and TikTok today. Hadn't even posted anything about the show last night. And people are commenting saying, what was this edit? What was this edit? Because the artist was really big in Lima, Peru. So oh, also I saw this post from a, a blog called EDM Peru. It's like James Hype remixes. Dora dos horas and it's not about two whores I was like whoa this is crazy we made an impact here so oh boy just did it again I made this remix in about 20 minutes and I'm not even exaggerating it is the most rough around the edges thing I will have ever have played in a club um even listen how shit the production is like but this tune bro Una Noche in Medellin by Chris MJ from Chile. Sick energy. How many girls do you think he's got? 
mucho. The bass just seems like really shit. I mean, let's see how this, <laughs> this might not hit at all. Um, yeah, I literally made this in 20 minutes while I was trying to eat a steak. Oh, we're supposed to be going in two minutes. Rashawn's gonna get really angry. I'm not ready at all. But do you know what? We're always about half an hour early to a gig. So really I could be half an hour late and we'd be on time. What are you laughing was? <laughs> I can just hear Rashawn's reaction to you saying that. <laughs> do you know what he'll do? He'll just change the time. He'll be like, oh, now I'm going to tell him he needs to be half an hour earlier. Yeah. Okay, so i just got to sync my... Oh, no, I've just realised I need to... I'm going to have to take my laptop with me because I need to create a set, like some sort of preparation for the gig. I'm going to prepare my set in the car, so let's go. Are we filming? Yeah. <laughs> So you know when we haven't slept much, we use a lift gang to wake ourselves up. I missed it. So now we're in the car already, missed the lift, but I got this. Fucking ready. Right, I actually really need to put a set together for tonight. <laughs> um, Have you not done that yet? I ain't done shit, bro. <laughs> I, I was making a record. I made I made a remix of some fucking artist from Chile. Santiago. No, he's not from Santiago, but he is from Chile. Did yeah, bro. Yeah, then I did an interview <laughs> with you. Oh my days. I, mean, I haven't been using my time very wisely. No, to be fair, I have. I can. I can. I could just play a similar set to like last night or the night before. It'll be fine. Yeah, wing it, mate. You'll be alright. Yeah, wing it, mate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Put a donk on it. Thanks. <laughs> Transition. <laughs>
Yeah. Someone's staring at me so mad. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's the next morning. I've had five hours sleep in two nights. Doesn't sound that bad to be fair. But yeah, that's that's where we're at. I feel really shit. But we're about to board a 14 hour flight back to London. So if you can't sleep on there, then you're screwed. Um, the show last night, 9.5. I'm sorry it wasn't a 10. I felt like I needed to shit myself the whole time. And <laughs> TMI. It, I know, it's nobody's <laughs> fault. It's just, um, it was a crazy day of travel, no sleep. And uh, it didn't agree with my inside. So I was like holding in, like, I was like, Ugh. the crowd was sick. The club was sick. I actually loved it. I think, do you know what, it's a 10, right? You know what, despite the complications, complications we had, I have no CO2. Anyway, um, it was a nine for me, you know. It was a nine. The sound was busting. The crowd was a mad thing. Yeah. Sick. I'm gonna say nine. Yeah, it would have been in and around the tens, but there was a couple, couple weirdos in the crowd. They weren't hype. <laughs> they weren't, they weren't hype fam. Of course, I had this woman who just pour water over my leg. Well, it wasn't water. Just stare at me and laugh, and that was a bit weird. But yeah, apart from that, it was sick. Yeah, I enjoyed it. That brings us to the end of a crazy episode of Moving Differently. Don't forget, my tracks with Tita Lau vibrate and on the ground are out right now. And I'm going to call it, as of you watching this, they're both in the Beatport Top 10. So go and buy them. Thank you. Appreciate you. Who does this? Transition. Feeling the beat to my soul vibrate.